Hi, I'm Anna Maria De Freitas, owner of the Harrison House Suites, Tucker House Inn, and Coho Restaurant in Friday Harbor, San Juan Island. Today, I'm going to demonstrate how to make a sandwich loaf with cream cheese. So I have a baguette, and I've cut the baguette in thirds. Traditionally, this uh, sandwich was done with white bread, or and you take the crust off of it, and then you fill it with like a deviled egg or um, a ham salad. So I'm doing a Mediterranean uh, version of this uh, sandwich. So in the first layer here, I'm going to take some hummus. I'm going to spread some hummus here. And then some roasted red peppers. I kind of left them a little charred and smoky to add some flavor. Okay, so my second layer is going to have some pesto. All these great savory flavors. Some feta cheese. And some black olives. These are Kalamata olives that I pitted. Again, this is a really flexible sandwich. Just think about the favorite things that you'd like to have in your sandwich. And, and then lastly, I'm going to add some grilled asparagus. The trick is going to get everything to balance here nicely. And then I'm going to put the cap on top. So here's where the cream cheese comes in. So I've taken some cream cheese. I've whipped it with a little bit of ricotta cheese and some chives to give it some flavor. And we're going to just frost it as if we were doing a cake. And if I have enough left, I'm going to pipe around the bottom. and We're going to make it look just like a cake. I say the trick is going to get everything to stay inside and not to peek out. It's sort of like doing a chocolate cake with white icing. I'm going to leave the ends open because I think it's going to be nice to show what's actually in there. And if you're using cream cheese, you know, make sure you whip it so it's very spreadable. And I'm glad I added a little bit of the chives in here so if anything pokes out of the sandwich, it looks like it's intentional. Okay, so there's that side done. And we'll flip around and we'll do the other side. I'm using a wonderful seeded bread that we make at the inn. It's a sourdough base with poppy seeds and sunflower seeds and sesame seeds. So it's got a lot of great texture. So it'll hold up to all these flavors. look a little nice. And then I'm just going to pipe a little scallop on the bottom. And I'll just do the, keep doing all four sides. So it's just kind of like cake decorating. So these are some borage flowers. I'm going to give it a little bit of color. And then I have some chai flowers. I'm put one in each one of these little scallop things. A tweezer would probably work really nicely for this. It's fun having all these edible flowers in the season. They not only make things look pretty, but they actually just extend the flavor profile. So there you have your layered sandwich loaf with cream cheese. Bon appetito.